So recently, the Division 2 has been making headlines. When I first saw this, which was on Twitter, I was like, God damn it. And I was thinking about how my PS4 ejected the disc for the Division. The whole day, I was like, how am I going to ever fix that? And then when I went back into lunch break, I saw the Division 2 uh, announcement. And I was like, oh my god. It's about to fucking happen. I'm going to play this freaking game the whole year. I'm telling you right now. And one of the things that really shocked me, though, is that some of the YouTubers that hated the first one are now jumping with excitement and having orgasms all over the goddamn place. And they're like, oh, I'm going to buy this game and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, bro, you hated the game in the first place, man. Jesus. Wait, don't, don't jump back. Leave the spotlight to me, all right? <laughs> Leave the spotlight to me. So anyways, uh, today, people, I want to talk about my wish list for The Division 2. I want to tell you guys what setting this should be on or what kind of content it should improve on and uh, we should be able to get the perfect the division 2 so first things first of course the city where should this game take place because the first one took place in new york we did play half of the island and uh it wasn't bad to be honest to me it was super fun i like scavenging around it's just that seeing buildings after buildings after buildings after buildings parking lot garage and buildings i mean it just became repetitive of course after a while but uh overall i consider the first division super freaking fun once you get into like into the game so um hopefully it does take place like maybe in a in a map where they do have like an open area i'm talking about plains or a hill or maybe a tiny mountain or something like let us breathe you know i don't want to see more buildings i don't want to see a bunch of highways everywhere i want to see an open field where i can like hide behind a tree and something like that maybe if they're gonna make it in new york they better add central park if they're gonna make it somewhere else they better have some kind of an open hill area where it's gonna be kind of impossible to hide and make it more challenging so if they're gonna do that part of the dark zone i mean it's gonna be fucking awesome so uh hopefully the new city will be like chicago like they could go with a dog with a watchdog place or they can go with uh, los angeles they do have a lot of streets over there a lot of suburban area uh some few drainage locations there uh, also the city of dallas I wish it would take a place in Texas, you know, that would be amazing, man, shit, it's not even close to a shore, so it will be mostly like a big-ass city with a bunch of highways and maybe a little bit of an open area, because I know I've been in Dallas and there's some few open areas out there that we might want to see in the division, so, um, also they have a lot of monuments, so it wouldn't be a bad idea, the division, to, to like, be hosting Dallas in it, so it would be amazing to see Dallas. Anyways, um, another kind of content that I kind of want to see improved will be the PvP. Of course, a lot of people kind of complained that we only had the Dark Zone to like roam around and kill people. And people wanted some kind of like 5v5, 6v6, so we can kind of test out our new gear against each other. Like a lot better and more like uh, more in a competitive state. Um, yeah, hopefully it does start with some kind of a game like that. We have the Dark Zone and next to the Dark Zone we got the freaking guy who's crazy he's gonna be like hey come over here we got a like, competition between gears and stuff like make make a crazy guy introduce us to this new pvp mode 6v6 and be like hey you know want to be competitive whatever boom jump into a menu and be like you want to play team deathmatch you want to play domination whatever blah, blah blah you know add that game mode in there immediately i don't want to see no vanilla the division being like oh it's already dark zone that's it like no add more pvps because if you do not add more pvp modes i mean people are going to be like oh is the division one all over again so if they do add that um it will be a, an incredible upgrade like immediately right off the jump start um hopefully it's not snowing all the time <laughs> please no more snow i'm tired of it i want to see more of a day and night cycle be different every single day rainy be windy be you know be more different you know that's all i'm asking for when you setting new fresh areas to explore um hopefully the subway systems too man i love the subway uh weaponry uh keep it simple keep it the same you know i love the customization and lo i love the how i can customize my site my uh my muzzle my magazine or extended mag you know whatever it just keep it the same do not give us preset weapons please i'm begging you do not pull off a battlefield because that will piss me off the most character customization hopefully goes beyond just like uh, ghost recon's wildlands it did an incredible job on customization too so if they can do the same thing with the division that will be even more amazing 
So that is it guys, I wanted to talk about, it's just a short list, just for now, maybe I'll do another video in the future, but uh, just for now, you know, just letting you know, the Division 2 for sure, for sure will be coming into this channel, it will be an amazing game for sure, um, no way I will doubt this game, man, the, that development team is doing a hell of a job improving the game every single year, it's done more improvements than the Call of Duty franchise has done on their own games over the years, except for the Black Ops series though, they have been doing a lot of updates lately, recently, so, um, um, so yeah, that's it. That's all I want to talk about. Leave your opinion in the comment section and I'll read it later. See you guys later. Subscribe for more.